My name is Rizama Ibrahim. I'm a fashion designer, home designer, wedding designer, check of all trades, but master of everything. It all started 25 years ago. So I was inspired by my siblings because we have eight together in the family and I'm the youngest. And I'd always be surrounded by my sisters, my four sisters. I was being exposed to female figures a lot and how my sisters get dressed and how they put on their makeup. So my, my mother, you know, um, take care of the domestic aspect of the house. And I think that contributes a lot of my passions towards what I'm doing now. So when I grew up as, uh, as students, as a school students, you know, of course, many of my siblings were not already inside the house. They have, you know, been married and then have their own family. And I was really being left alone with my mother and my, and my, you know, my dad and things like that. I was quite really independent, you know. There's no one to help my mother to clean up her house and to take care of the house. And there's no one, you know, to look after my father and things like that. So I was really being forced into situations like you're the only child that, you know, at that particular age, you know, that you have to do it. That really makes, you know, uh, sort of like a responsibility for myself to change the value of my families. And, you know, I just promised myself, you know, just to go out from the house and find plenty of money and just to feed them with good life and things like that. So, uh, three and a half after my uh, high school livings, I straight away find a job, become a, a waiter at, at one of the hotels in Penang. So, uh, and then I enrolled myself to Mara Institute of Technology with a pocket money of 100 ringgit. So I think that has been sort of like a kickstart for me to, you know, a turning point like, Rizalman, you have to do this, you know. As, as a child, this is your duty to your parents first, then whatever comes later is probably a blessing from them or from God. Actually, I wanted to become an interior designer, but it was rejected. So I was being pulled into uh, fashion faculty. So I said, why not, you know, just try out my lots and then uh, the magic happens because um, people saw my graduation work, which at that time I took um, bridal wear as my uh, final project. So it was being featured in that bridal magazine at that month. So we have received a lot of phone calls from there. I still remember that I'm the only one who actually used my real name, which is Rizalma Ibrahim, as a brand name to a label so that it will be at par with Christian Dior and Valentino in the future, I guess. A great man comes with a great people's behind him. So, like, lighting apa yang dia orang bagi dekat kita? The longest people who has been behind me is Faisal. He has come to my personal and business life for the past 12 years. We have been um, partnering in designing many years already, and uh, to sort of like um, give him something back. I have willingly opened a new company called Glam Wedding and took him on to a sort of like a director into the company and let him manage the company himself with the help from me, of course. So, tangan semua, you... Hello. Hello. So, ini ada, ada dad, dad kan? Uh, Tapi ini okay. tak ada dad. Uh. Okay, this is my workstation. Uh, basically, I'm a co-designer dekat Rizalman. Dia tak 
lagi. I have my own client under Rizam Ibrahim. So selalunya siapa yang tak nak di charge mahal tu dia akan pergi pada I lah. Selalunya my client akan pergi dekat kata ni lah. Kata ni yang selalu yang more to simple design which is baju kurung, baju kebaya, kebarung, everything. Jarang lah I turun sebab I belum busy. Tapi ada hari ni yang akan turun juga pada untuk workshop untuk tengok tak mana baju I tu yang I nak kena tengok lah. My schedule is quite packed because I have several meetings before early in the morning and then uh, two fittings for my regular clients, which is uh, Sofia and her daughter Tia. They are my uh, very loyal and regular clients. What trophy is that? Trophy. It's a Spanish trophy. It's a Spanish trophy meaning? Sofia is one of the clients, one of the Lady of Leisure groups, you know, which belongs to this couture circles. So from there, we have been friends and uh, recently she has been making a lot of baju because she has a lot of functions to attend. It's for tomorrow. It's for tomorrow. We're supposed to attend a birthday party, right? Oh my God. What do you think of it? Huh? So the dresses that they made just now is to attend uh, one of the birthday parties that they need to attend this coming weekends. Their friends, their closest friends. And uh, my duty is to design a uh, mom's daughter kind of thing, but in a very subtle way. Oh, look at the flare. Wow, I think you're gonna go on your whole night that. The baju is somehow very glittery since that it's just going to be something for her to attend a, uh, a birthday party, I made it into quite semi-casual looking. Every time there's an event, he's always the first thing that's in my mind. I just have to tell him the theme and he will come up with uh, the design. It's that simple. I, I need not have to think, <laughs> not even a second. I said that I to birthday girl. Imagine going to People's birthday party, wearing like this. <laughs> Sometimes it's quite silly for you guys to know. You know, she make baju just to attend birthday parties. Simple things like attending her daughter violin class and things like that. But if you have the money, why not just splurge it? Because then it helps the whole economic situation like that. This is a typical my morning meeting with all my staff and suddenly uh, we had a very urgent project to execute. Earlier, I had a meeting with someone, representative from another company, came to me and um, wants to offer me as a brand ambassador for their up and coming uh, ad campaign. Actually, um, soft furnishings, you look at the last page to it. We get you to join us for the photo shoot. So, yeah, on board for the photo shoot. So, basically, uh, Dato akan advise lah kita, uh, okay, how's the, what's the trend for this year? And they uh, presented me the products and the whole art directions. Uh, of the campaigns, which is going to bear my face and my figures in it. And it looks horrible. I've knew this uh, going to come, but, you know, I'm just going to make sure, oh, maybe probably today or this time around, this is going to do a bit different because Rizalman is in by Eden. So, I told them that if you want me to be inside this ad campaign, you have to take my whole team. This whole team knows what Rizalman is all about and they agreed, so we did have uh, an urgent meeting. Katil dah ada, cuma am tak balik ke aku super single. Aku tak tahu semalam. Pergi ke mana? Tak ada. Tak hantar pun super single. Dia cuma kata tilam saja ke aku. Super single tak ada. 
So they actually um, had a meeting, urgent meeting at the early morning. So um, I'm at the site during that time. So I got a call from the other staff, asked me to come the, to the office um, to join the meeting. And then I, I was a bit surprised because I didn't know about that. I'm just newly joined Glam Casa. He's the one who can actually be scolded without taking any, you know, sensitivity to himself. Unless you have a valid reason, then only I will accept. If not, because you know what, this is very urgent. Hello, you all, you lamba, then we all have to wait for you. I like people who is actually willing, you know, to be scolded and learn something new every time, you know and without running away from the company. So, colour, modern raya collection, there's print and embellishment. So... Kalau ada, kalau tak ada, kita tak janji. Uh. Tanya saja cakap dia. But dia pun tak, ada dia nanti pun tak pun, uh. Today, I have to execute all the team to rush and do all the preparation. At least to be ready. Uh, I'm afraid that um, we are lacking some time because there's a lot of agreement, there's a lot of uh, discussion with everyone with um, other teams. So I hope they can manage well and get all the stuff done. Umi is my fourth PA. The last three ran away because I, you know, uh, scolded them. So far, Umi uh, has stayed quite a long time. She's really understand my um, whole situation. She prepares everything and she, as you know, she, as a PA, she, she should be looking uh, so many areas of Rizalman stars and everything. And so far, she has, um, you know, delivered that. And she always travel with me because I don't want to get to know about my luggage, about my itinerary, about everything. So she handles everything. Um, you know, Rizalman Ibrahim, um, he's uh, the most meticulous person i ever known. So it is compulsory to be um, very resourceful, very multitask person. Which is, you cannot think in the box, you have to think outside of the box. So I have to, I have to make myself very um, aggressive and proactive. You have, to, you have to be very resourceful, that's all. <laughs> Kenapa senyap sini? Kita tidak online, kita tidak awkward. So today we did a we did a fitting to one of my longest client, I guess, uh, which is Diana Faiza. I'm receiving a couple of new fabrics coming from Europe. It's fabulous. I, I'm going to keep some for you. Yes, the oldest, you know, the sombonus baju. Okay, at first I just want to become a designer design clothes. But then over the years, you know, I think it has been good and then I've changed myself, evolved myself to a celebrity. So now I only have a very small group of artists which has been nurtured them, styled them for years and they are becoming a diva now. Diana Faiza has, for an example. Do you see my grey hair? Ah. See? Just yeah. because I'm doing your baju. <laughs> The grey hair becomes more and more on my head. Diane came and see me to fit her latest clothes which I've designed for her. That particular clothes she's going to wear in one of the prestige uh, music events for the main award, which is Song of the Year. Conscious? <laughs> Nella, Zama never fails to make me look amazing. My next song yes. is... Yeah. <laughs> she was really happy. Uh, this time was really chic and slick. Um, and uh, by giving her pants, I guess she is really comfortably, you know, can comfortably move on the stage. And I hope this time around that she is going to win the best songs of the year. Actually designed um, with her preferences and uh, 
knowing her with her vast vocals, you know, and then I have to understand that she likes to do this and she likes to kick her legs when she. Yang senang dengan zaman sebab he understands me very well dan he knows uh, what style and look yang uh, sesuai dengan Dayang. So bila kita discuss, then just discuss the song macam mana, and then dia akan keluar dengan his ideas macam tu. <laughs> If the designers and also the artists, as for this case, the singers, you know, collaborate, um, designer also helps a lot to the industry. As um, it's on Hollywood, you see, you know, they come with a battalion of people that comes with the stylists, makeup, hairdressers, like that. So it's the same thing here in Malaysia. I mean, I have that credibility to do, you know, to say yes or no to every one's appearance, whether it's, which I think it should be corrected or shouldn't be corrected, yes. Butler, you know. Yes, loci itu bunyi untuk Aris saja dalam kabin ini. Maksudnya bos yang memang nak cepat. I like the word of battling because it really shows how a human being um, really putting efforts towards traditions, towards uh, formality, towards uh, you know, hormat people and things like that. For me, it's someone who is always 24 hours around you and dedicating their life towards you and sort of like, you know, they know what you want before even you actually ask from them. And I have been training Ari for so many years from now and um, it looks that he has been, you know, taking a lot of ideas and ways of thinking from me. And which is, I like that because, you know, probably I've inspired him in so many ways. Today I'm going to shoot uh, Rizal Man, as in MBN, one of the brands that carries my male collection. Last year, we used a professional models to do the ad campaign for Rizal Man. But this year around, I think, why don't we cut costs a little bit by having me myself as the model. I like silent. Ali is a child who is very me, he likes likes cameras, action kind of a situation. So he wants to follow me to the to the situation to the to the site. So I brought him along and then he wants sometimes want to wear something like me, like what I'm wearing at that time. So we make a mini version specially made for him. The result man black shirts for him to wear and so-called like, you know, he's part of the ad campaign. Okay, today there's a lot of people around me. Uh, there's people from the uh, fashion departments, my co-designers, my makeup artists, my stylists, and uh, my butler. And my son is joining me today. So yes, um, I'm very um, happy and very um, nervous at the same time because uh, you know posing for my own clothes in my own ad campaign for Rizal Man. The story is a, a day with a designer, so it's more like a daily kind of uh, photo, very lifestyle, very relaxed. But uh, yeah, at the same time, we still have to bring out his outfit, and that's my ch challenging part of today. I think that's we have done. Agree? Yep. Okay. Happy? Okay. Right. All right. All right. It's a wrap, everyone. I'm quite tired, you know, it's time to go back and pack for Paris tomorrow morning. We're leaving. Uh, so hopefully the end products, uh, after it's been post-productions by the photographers, and uh, I hope it's, it turned out to be 
really good because uh, me myself is not a model, but I'm trying to be one. So uh, thank you to all the team today. Uh, excellent job, excellent service, and thank you to the venue. You know, it's beautiful. It's very nice with all these shadows, and it's quite windy today. So uh, thank God everything went well. So I'm happy, and I uh, really wanted to see the end product soon. I guess. What is this? Where you wanna go? Huh? <laughs> you wanna follow me? Allah, Baba go to Paris for work. We just came back from London what, last month. Hmm? Okay, let, let me let me. So this is how a designer's life in a day. I have family to take after too. I have business. I have everything in one day. This has made me such a very strong person. But then again, above all this, I'm enjoying it. I'm loving it. I hope all this has been inspiring to myself and people around me. Come here, back. Come here. Givenchy. This is uh, the time in that every year which I have to travel uh, in January for me to you know, attend the Maison Object uh, exhibition in Paris. And then this time around, I'm going to conclude also our uh, Zalora latest ad campaign for 2017 High Royal Collection. So there will be a lot of purposes uh, for me to go to Paris this time around. You want to select my shoes, which one? Okay, which one? Which one do you think I should wear? Red colour? Yeah. Cannot. It's winter. Ali, when I'm in Paris, you be a good boy, okay? Ali, be a good boy, okay? Leaving your kids behind is something which is very hard to do, especially when you have a kid that age four years old where you know, he is very clinging and very cuddling to you and um, you know that you just want to make sure that everything is well with him when you leave him around and like that. So, yeah, I mean, what else can I do as a father and also an entrepreneur and a great designer? I mean, you have to balance your life and you have to make do with whatever that comes in front of you and embrace them and enjoy. Next time, you follow me to Paris, OK? Bye. I want these lights to be here. The beam is supposed to fall on the paneling. I not really like the situation. <laughs> it's so strong. Let's go, Ali. Mama. 